Impressive catch, Esteban. If you thought that was impressive, Mr. Mosby, watch this. Hey! Ooh, I can hear the ocean. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm fine. Nothing happened to me. I am okay. You, you saved my life. Oh, Mr. Mosby. Thank you for saving my life, Mr. Mosby. In my country, my life now belongs to you. I want those kids out of here. Anyone without a room key is on the street. Well, since my life now belongs to you, I must obey this harsh command. Psst, Zach, Cody, I need to speak with you. What's up, Esteban? I have been given a terrible task. I have been ordered to rid the premises of children by Mr. Mosby. Now, I could disobey him, but Mr. Mosby reminds me of my father, who was also strict, demanding ruthless and mean. Oh, I miss my papa so much. It's okay. I need a moment. Hey, Esteban Mosby's yelling for you. For me? He never yells for me. He yells at me, but only when I deserve it, which is often. <laughs> He's a great man. Well, you're keeping a great man waiting. Oh, but this dress must go to London. We'll take it. Oh, bless you, little blonde peoples. Here, you receive the facts. The Tipton Hotel inspector is on the way for surprise inspection. How can it be a surprise inspection if they sent a fax? Because the fax came two weeks ago and I forgot to give it to you. Surprise! Now, fortunately for all of us, my hotel is always in tip-top, tipped-in shape. And nothing has changed since the last inspection. <laughs> Except for that. When is the hotel inspector going to be here? Zach and Cody are going to be back any minute. Oh, don't worry, Mr. Mosby. Per your instructions, I am gluing down the vase. Soon, it will be twin-proof. Oh, oh, oh! Thank you, Esteban. You can let go now. I wish I could. They don't call it mega glue for nothing. Oh. Mr. Mosby? That's right, may I help you? I am Ilsa schickel Gubermeiger, the Tipton Hotel Inspector. Yes, of course. We were expecting you hours ago. I got held up at Logan Airport. Mm, traffic? No, the whole luggage system stinks. I had to redo it. <laughs> Welcome to the Tipton. Mr. Mosby, do you realize you are wearing a bellhop? <laughs> Very droll. It goes with your devastating good looks. <laughs> are you staying at my beauty mark? Yes. Oh. Would you stop that? Yes, sir. Ooh, I love the vest look on you, sir. But like your sleeves, I'm off. Esteban. Yes, sir. Ma'am. What is that non-regulation pin you are wearing on your Tipton uniform? It belonged to my great-grandfather who died fighting for my country's independence. How touching. Take it off. <laughs> I'm watching you. Esteban, what is going on with the computer? Oh, I don't know. Every time I push a button, I get a picture of a koala bear. Ooh, and he's doing a dance. <laughs> Have you tried to restart it? Oh, only Mr. Mosby knows how. I've tried everything. Have you tried this? Oh, you have broken it. Oh. <laughs> Oh, no, the water is up to my neck, losing air fast. There's water in my hotel. Maddie, why do you let London treat you like a cute blonde pack mule? Uh, I borrowed some money from her and used it to buy the tickets for my parents' trip to Paris. Now I'm paying for it in blood, sweat, and tears. Oh, you must be desperate. Have you no more kidneys to sell? Sadly, no. Hi, Esteban. Oh, it's a little man. And he's carrying a little man. 
I love your hair. Uh, thanks. Well, then I was talking to the littler men. Oh. I think I found my talent. It's ventriloquism. I got this guy cheap because he scares little kids. Mm -hmm. Hello, Throckmorton. Hello, Cody. Tell me, Throckmorton, do you know where cows go on dates? The movies! Hey, 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 you get it, yeah. Oh, that was yeah, wonderful. Cool. It is amazing how your lips and his move at the same time. That's not supposed to happen. Oh, well, in that case, you're no good. Aim off. Maddie, yeah. I can watch this no longer. London is treating you like a dog. Oh, I wish. Now her dog's upstairs in the hot tub, which reminds me, I have to give her a massage. I cannot believe she's making you give her shih tzu a shiatsu. Yeah, well, until I give her $250 back, I'm scraping biscotis. Yes, but you are better than that. You must have self-respect. You must have dignity. And you must never, never kowtow to anyone. Esteban, I need you. When I'm good and ready. What did you say? Now I am good and ready. <laughs> Maddie. Can't talk. Lennon's thirsty. On behalf of the entire staff, we have raised this money so you can pay back London. And look your mirror in the face. That is so sweet. But I can't take this. Soda, please. Without saying thank you. Ask the boy! Oh, little blonde peoples, you scared me. I mean, people. Here's your mama's dry cleaning. Hold on. Don't you want to hang out? Oh, no. I have work to do. A group of bodybuilders are checking in. You'd think they'd carry their own luggage. Why don't you relax a little? Maybe play some alien kung fu slam jamma Oh, but that doesn't come out for another month. I've got my sources. Ah, you know my weakness. Put it in. Gotcha, alien scum. Oh, you did not, you missed. Then why'd your head explode? It doesn't matter. I'm a Zylon. So long, Zylon. Wait your turn. You're running out of life. Well, you're running out of reload, and I'm running out of patience. Oh, well, Mr. Mosby, I am so sorry. Your turn. Watch out for his intergalactic exploding taser. The only intergalactic explosion you need to worry about is mine. Oh, you didn't eat those spicy beans again, did you? Please get back to your job while you still have one. Yes, sir. I saw nothing. Okay, have fun. You can't do that.